What's up everybody, welcome to, no welcome, back to my channel, and uh, today I don't have my hair up or anything, I'm currently at Ryan's scooter store right now, we're chilling, and um, we actually like reorganized a little bit right here, so we have like more space and everything, we got a hoverboard in there and shoes, elite shoes and stuff, so I mean, we got some cool stuff, so if you guys want, come check us out and everything, but really quick, yeah, I'm like, um, greasing my scooter again, cause, I mean, it always gets hungry, so it's like, whatever. But um, you remember the trick that John Reyes did on his video where he was on his fork and his two pegs? Well, I want to try to reattempt it, and my camera's going to be, like, down here. But, oh, my God, this trick is so hard to land. I mean, no, just for the balancing. The balancing is, like, I don't even get how he even gets to, like, do it. I mean, but I'm going to try a little bit. If I fall, wish me luck. But... Uh, let me try it real quick. All right, guys. Um, it's currently dialed, you know, as always, but I'm gonna try to balance on these walls and get my foot at the correct position. Try to balance on these walls and then uh, try to go forward a little bit to see if it's possible for it to work out. But I mean, just staying on like this, I don't get how he does it. This is like so sketchy because <laughs> you have like nothing to hold on to. Usually I'll hold on to my bars, but I don't get how he does this. So he's like a master right now at like just doing flat land. So I mean. Ah. Uh, all right. Uh, I'm gonna put some tape on it really quick so I don't mess up that here. All right guys, I'm back. I just like taped a little bit so I don't mess it up, but. All right, here I go to try it again. Cause I don't wanna mess up my $90 fork, so. I mean, uh actually get into it and try it again. I'm gonna try to go all the way to you guys. I don't know if that's literally gonna happen, but uh, I'm gonna try my best. And I don't get how he does this. So. Oh my God. I don't understand how he does this. This is so hard. I mean, okay. You get the balance and it's cool, but I mean, it's like sketch, but uh, it's like, it's fun though. Low key, high key, high key actually fun. I mean, but it's a good balance trick to like learn your balance more better, even though, you know, I, you know, you do, if you do flatline or anything, it's a really good way to learn your balancing for your tricks, but if you're not holding on to anything, you're, you're gonna even know more how to balance without using your which is even better and which is even cooler. So it's good overall. Here we go. Ooh. That don't work too well. Oh. I made it so close. Oh my god, like this is it, I don't know, it just, it, ma it makes it worth it to learn this trick, but it's so, I mean, it's so fun, but also it's like, just, just learning the balance is the hardest part. Or he pushes off like this, and I don't get how he does even that. Oh my god. This is just so nuts. You guys, I just, I don't even know how to explain it. Like, I don't get how he does it on these, like, I mean, I get how he does it, but, I mean, it's it's really fun. If you have pegs, you ride front pegs, or if you guys want to ride front, front pegs to, like, ride it or whatever, and you guys want to, like, try it, try it. It's so worth it. Like, if you ever take your fork off again to do whatever, and you got pegs on it, or you go buy pegs to put on it, it's so worth to, like, to try and have fun. And actually get the trick because he's like one of the first people I have ever seen to do this. And I mean, it's really cool because you don't get to see it every single day. And if you see it in person, it's way cooler, like a mega spin. You might see it on camera, eh, it looks all right. You go and you see it in person, it's totally different. Like a flare. You see it on camera, it's whatever. And you see it in person, you're like, wow. Like, that's it's a whole different, different idea. So, I mean... It's very good to learn it and stuff. So, um, I'm gonna put my scooter together and like throw maybe three tricks for you. 
and then maybe call it a video. Oh, but real quick before, um, yesterday I was an anthem writing. I, I was supposed to film, but I didn't because I was kind of in the moment of just writing. So, uh, Pookie and I met my new friends at Anthem because they all called me John Reyes, and then we talked and we rode and it was fun. We all went to Dairy Queen, and then they they were gonna flip off the counter after we ate. So we have to, uh, we ate, and then they went and flipped off the counter, and I got on video, so I'll play it right now. Well, I've been saying, can I get a DQ flip this entire fucking time? I mean, sell it, you talk, you still got what you know, you know, Never! I got the camera ready! I got the camera <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, bro. Alright. Hey, 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 hey. Thank you, bro. Oh, oh, oh. Go, go. Oh. Stay close. Stay. Have a great day, bro. That's so bad. Oh, oh, oh. No, no, no. <laughs> Alright guys, I hope you guys, I hope you guys did enjoy that. Alright, I'm gonna put my scooter together, do like three tricks for you guys, and then I don't know. I might end the video, might not. Alright everybody, I just put the scooter together. There's a noise. I fixed the noise really quick. Now that sounds better. I'm gonna do about three tricks and then um Call today. He plays the poison that you left onto my mind. Maybe we'll meet again in another life. And there we go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you all tomorrow. I made just a little video of just all this because I just have to make a little bit of something. But, uh, yeah, thank you for watching. I'll see you later. And um, make sure you like the video. Subscribe if you didn't. And uh, if you like these tricks and tutorials and whatever I did then uh comment down below all right peace out